Hey everyone, I couldn't resist this beautiful ivy behind me. Guys, I just want to reiterate that this virus is attracted to fear. There are so many people in fear. I was just on the bus this morning and there were some uh, elderly people yelling at this elderly man because he chose to have his mask on his chin rather than on his mouth or his nose. Nobody knows what his physical condition is. Some people have trouble breathing and they can't wear masks, whatever it is. But the fear that is being permeated through the earth because of the media is totally unacceptable. Guys, we need to just keep our immune systems up and we need to pray over ourselves and we need to put our faith in the risen king. Nobody knows what tomorrow brings. And of course, if you don't have a relationship with Yeshua, with Jesus, and you're afraid of getting sick, it would be normal in your humanity to be afraid. But when you put your faith in the risen King, you can know and be secure that when you leave this earth, you are gonna be dancing in heaven with Jesus. This is the truth of the matter. Guys, we have rights, we have rights. And if we're so afraid to go out of our home, maybe we shouldn't go out of our home until we resolve that fear because fear draws this illness. You know, I talked about how the energy in Jerusalem has always been so awesome. It's like this feeling of anticipation where you just want to kick up your heels and run and leap. It's very exciting. Well, when we began to go into lockdown and the whole thing with the COVID, the atmosphere felt so, so different. And I asked the Lord, what is going on? And he said to my heart that it's all the fear of the people that's been released into the atmosphere, that oppressive fear. That's what I was feeling. We need to get it right with God because when it comes down to it, we came into the world with God. We're going out with God. If we put our faith in him, we need to find our security in him. And in him is the only safe place. God bless you from the city of rejoicing. Lots of love from Yerushalayim.